Hi everyone, today I'm going to be creating a Nika Bridal Makeup look. This is going to be a very beautiful eye makeup, but using very soft pink shades. So I'm starting by hydrating my model's skin. She has a little bit of acne and textured skin, so I'm working on that using a primer. And also moisturizing the skin so there is no dry patches. As it's winter, so you want to make sure that you're moisturizing the face really well. Then using a concealer, I'm just going into the areas that need a little extra concealing so that those areas don't turn grey later on. And dabbing it nicely, then starting to add foundation all over the face. As you can see, I'm blending it as I'm applying it so that it gives a smoother finish. Because it's a bridal look, we're keeping it slightly heavier, although after all, it will look very, very natural. So you want to start by contouring the face and adding some color. I use a little bit of cream blush before I started dabbing powder on the face. This is going to lock the makeup and keep it a very long stay. And then just topping up any of the contour areas with the contour shade itself so it doesn't become too light. For the eye makeup, I started with a transition shade which was very light pink. And then I started working it up with a slightly darker shade of pink. To further enhance the crease line, I went in with the brown eyeshadow, making sure it's not too dark, but also helps create a basic boundary for where we need to make our crease line. And then using a concealer, I drew the crease line and filled it in nicely. For filling in the eyeshadow for the crease, I used mauve and light pinks, moving in from the darker to the lighter shade. And in the front inner corner, I kept a cream white color and then I added a liquid glitter eyeliner to the crease line which further enhanced it and gave it a very finished look. I always like to draw my eyeliner before I start filling it in. So that's what I did. I drew the eyeliner's wing and then slowly worked it up and started filling it in which would further enhance and lift up the eyes. I added very heavy eyelashes for this look because the rest of the look is very soft and I thought why not try something new and different as usually I try to keep the eyelashes a little bit softer. And then for the lip again, I added a base color and then I topped it up with a different pink so that the eye makeup and the lip shade kind of blend well together and match. Also keeping the blush very soft, very pink and girly, wanting to make sure that there is color on the face, that there is some softness, girly innocence, and then working on the lower lash line, not making it too dark. Adding highlighter in a way that it blends very well with the blusher and just makes the face look very naturally glowy. And once you've done that, you'll see the face looks very, very soft and just giving final touch-ups to the lips using a lip liner so that the lips have a very even shape and the lip line looks absolutely finished and there is no harsh lines on the face either. If you notice, her eyebrows are also quite soft. So that's the final look that we created for this Nika Bridal Makeup look. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me create this look. Don't forget to like and share the video and subscribe to our channel for many more such different types of makeup looks and ideas for anything that you need to do your makeup for so guys don't forget to comment what you think about this look and if you do take something new from this video then don't forget to share that with us as well hope to see you guys again very very soon